You know, you bookend a record, I think that uh, when you close the, the chapter of this book, there was no way to do it than, than the song The River's Working. I remember being on a boat uh, out on the Mississippi River where I grew up, down around Greenville, Mississippi, between there and Lake Village, Arkansas, and uh, a song that I'd written and recorded, uh, Waiting on Joe, which was all about home. Uh, and I just, uh, I remember sitting there, they were setting up on the bridge, they had actually shut the bridge down for us. And uh, the captain walks out and he holds his cup, a coffee cup in there and he goes, the river's working. And I swear, I really felt like there was a tear in his eye, but it was, it was so hot that day, I, I just, I sort of gave him, you know, threw a bone and just said, okay, it's sweat. <laughs> but uh, I started thinking immediately about, you know, all the, all the people and their lives on the river and how I had friends whose dads were always gone and when they'd come home they never settled in. They, you know, big hugs and then they were sort of antsy and never settling in on dry land and I couldn't get it out of my head. The look in his eye, looking out on the river and seeing just countless barges and tugs pulling them and I just, I said, man, that, that's, a, that's gonna be something and for the next 48 hours, that's all I could think about. When I was shooting the Waiting on Joe video, it was all about the rivers working. I couldn't get it out of my head and I couldn't wait to write it. Um, I do believe that it really uh, shows the, you know, the real, the real ways of the Delta and, the, and how important the river was uh, for so many to make a living. And uh, when it dried up, so did jobs. And, uh, and, and, you know, between farming and agriculture and that, that was it. So, um, you know, they've had a tough, tough go at it on the river down there.